And what's going on everybody? We're we'll here for the Rodeo Plays and welcome back to another episode of The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim right here on the channel. So last time we left off, we answered the Greybeard's call, calling out for, well, let's start with this. First of all, found out where Dova came, and then we heard the Greybeard's calling for Dova King. So we made our way to High Hrothgard. I'm pretty sure I'm still butchering that name because that shit is difficult to do. Then we continued to trade with the Greybeards for a little bit before they gave us our final task of going to a mysterious dungeon to collect a horde of one of the previous Greybeards known as Jorgen Windcaller. And that's what we're going to do in this episode. So yeah. Uh, first things first, where is the closest area to this? God fucking damn, I got a trip to go. What is this? Morthal? Oh, fuck, I ain't going to Morthal. Alright, uh, easiest plan. Um, I'm starting from the stables. And we will take a carriage ride to Morthal. Because that's something we can do here. Which, thank fucking God. I don't got time to be taking that long ass trip. Ah. But, uh, yeah. So, my plans for this episode. I shouldn't have used the camera on my phone, but fuck it. But, yeah. My plans for this episode is, um, essentially, we're going to do this. So we're going to do this, and then for the next few episodes, I'm going to come back, and we're actually going to do some of the um, Companions Guild quest line. Mm, so yeah, anyways. Need a ride? We're Hiring a carriage. Morthal. We'll we'll Alright. Tell me what the fuck to do. Fuck yeah, I had your goddamn carriage. I'm going to be sitting down here forever. But, uh, yeah, I'm basically, um, but, uh, yeah, so basically my plan is this episode we're going to do this whole thing, and then I'm going to go out of my way to do the campaign guild, because that's just, uh, really fucking close. I mean, not close, but, like, ah, my words are everywhere at the moment, but, like, it's just something I want to do. I know that. I could not give a fuck about what y'all are going through right now. Actually, no, it's not that I could. I just choose not to. Uh, alright. So, we are on the run. Uh, next time I level up, I need to level up my light armor, too. So that way, uh, uh, so I can get the second rank of Agile Defender. Because, uh, yeah, more defense means, uh, more defense means I can take more of a beating. Haven't had a problem where I've been uh, killed yet, but uh, we're, which is great, but also we're trying to ensure that we can avoid such a problem, so yeah. Alright. Also, I'm level 9, and once I hit level 10, uh, stuff for the DLCs, more so speaking, the uh, Dawnguard DLC and the Dragonborn DLC are going to start popping off, so uh, once again, not going to immediately just jump to them. Um, but, uh, yeah, is that a fucking spider over there? Hang on, let's figure this shit out. Let's figure this shit out ahead of time, because if it is, I'm, I'm, gonna, to I'm gonna toast to his ass, because... Oh, uh, okay. I was gonna say, is that a fucking spider mode? Because I'm... I'm I, I high-key don't like fucking with spiders. Like, I think I brought this up back in, like, episode one. But your boy is a bit uh, arachnophobe. It has a bit of a... Uh, Arachnophobia sitting at him, so, uh, not fun. Oh, okay. Enemies, that's cool. Oh, we fight and fight now here. Okay. I want a piece of this. I want some of this. Aww. Uh -huh. I thought that was gonna last longer. Uh, you got antlers. Plus your number is fire. I'll take that. I'll take your dagger, too. Uh, what you got? Axe, I can sell that. Uh, what you got? You had a two-headed weapon, didn't you? Gold, uh, Nord weed. I'll take this. Cool. Alright. And I'm going to actually save right here. Well, I want a quick save. Look in here. A shield. Elven helmet. Ooh. And it's better than what I got. Um... I'll take the gold, do go, go. I'll take the shield too, because I think I can just get it to Lydia. I'm about to say, Lydia, where the fuck are you at? Taking your sweet ass time. Still here. 
Boom. Land it the third. How can I serve you, my friend? Uh, weapons? I don't have a weapon to really give you. Um, apparel though. You could have, uh, that. And, uh, you could have this other steel armor that I'm just carrying on because why the fuck not? I got everything. I got all my shit together. Great. <laughs> I keep looking at my goddamn phone. My phone about to fucking die. Oh, it's dark as shit in here. These thralls of yours are slower than Argonians in a blizzard. Feel free to grab a pick and help them out. I prefer not selling myself with the Actually, since you guys are, uh. There goes another one. Bah, weak willed rabble. Even dead, they're almost useless. Actually, you know what? No, 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 no. Because she's a. Because she's a Dako Master. And they were just. Less intelligent each time you raise them. Yeah, there we go. Ah, uh, what am I doing? Because you're a necromancer. Ah, uh, you're a conjurer, though. That it? Is that your best? Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Simple shit. So, yeah. Just a quick hint for battle. If you want shit to go easier for you, uh, if you realize you're fighting a necromancer, just, uh, kill the necromancer first and then deal with everybody else. If you kill a necromancer, everybody else just perish. So, uh, yeah. It's dark as shit in here. Like, Jesus Christ, it's dark as shit. And I leveled up. So, uh, let's do stamina. Oh, can't do this. Oh, okay, so I already did this. Got it. Uh, in that case, then let's increase. One hand it. So, my power attacks, uh, take 25% less, uh, stamina. Which is great. Do I have a goddamn torch? No, I don't. The one time. God damn it. Alright. Uh, plan B. Uh, not clairvoyance. Hell no. Um, destruction. I had this as a favorite. I should probably fit that too. Gotta use fucking fire spells and shit so I find a torch. Oh, y'all. Oh, y'all fighting, fighting over here. Who got that ass beat? Who are? Of course the zombies won. Why am I surprised? Uh. Uh. Oh, Lydia, you almost got burned. Damn. Damn. Okay, Lydia. Fuck. You ain't need my whole shit. My bad. Fuck. Let me, let me step out your way. Taking this bone meal and this gold. Taking this gold because I'm broke as fuck. Uh, like, I'm big. Like, I'm broke when I'm not broke. That's crazy. Um, can I get a torch, please? It's dark as shit in here. And it... <sighs> Man, I can't see shit. Lighting here fucking sucks. I know I installed this mod for uh, quality of life, but goddamn, I'm about to uninstall this bitch. It's dark as hell. Mmm. Mmm. Hey, what's poppin'? Oh, 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 we trade a blow. I don't like that. Take your gold. Alright, so yeah, next episode, I am definitely, I'm definitely, uh, taking this bot off the, off the load order. Because, uh, as much as it is great, um, it's dark as balls in here. And I don't like being in dark areas. Ooh, chest. 25 gold. What's that? Potion of the warrior. Don't need nothing else. Great. Alright, we, we're going the right way though. So, uh. Yeah. Ooh, bag of gold. Also, I forgot I'm playing an Imperial. So, this works out even better for me. Because I'm finding just a little bit more gold in the areas we go to. Alright. 
Damn, my torch, but can I take that off the wall? No. No. Could I? Never seen anything quite like that. I mean, that is the way I'm supposed to go, but. Mm. I, w uh, I was going to, and I was like, mm, I do not have this ship ready for this. Can I just, uh, I don't have this set, because this is a trap. Let's switch back to our Olympic Force, because it's just a better shout. I'm going to get plucked the fuck off, I feel it. I lied. Oh, okay. I can't check this. It's, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah, what's good? Alright, what you got on you? Uh, not shit. Great. Keep it a pushing. Uh, there is not shit here for me. I'm gonna just keep walking. I mean, it's an urn. Uh, 14 gold. Uh. Back up here. Then we come across over here. If I can keep lighting my damn path up like this, like like I said, this is cool for quality of life, but other than that, it's like I could not care. I know nope, Lydia, why would you do that? Bitch, you don't want to walk in that fire. Ain't nobody do that shit to you. Run low. Oh, ain't going to be bitching at me. Uh, anyways, what's in your pocket? Gold! Oh, nice shit up here. That's cool. <laughs> Alright. Uh, where the fuck am I going? That's the way I need to go. I can see the Draugr and I don't... Oh, there it is. Oh, no, that's not a Draugr. It's a skeleton. Damn, fool. You need some more meat on the bones. Alright, I had fun with my five seconds. I had fun with no five seconds. With no five seconds. Damn, is there a torch anywhere? Lydia, what the fuck are you doing? Lydia? I was about to say, what the fuck do you see, Lydia? You're sitting in the backfield, like, eh. Come on. Come on. The bone, the bony calcium. Watch out. The bone, the bony calcium. Alright, so I remember this puzzle. You gotta trigger all these in one motion and then whirlwind sprints. What? There we go. Oh, they, they just okay. And then we enter the worst part about the game. Got a bad feeling about this. Mmm, it's dark as shit too, so I don't like it. So uh this place has spiders. Yay! It's kind of the reason I fucking hate this dungeon. We're near the end though. Like, don't get it twisted. It's just like Mmm, my hands didn't clear me and I don't fucking like it. So here's what happened. Lydia, okay. you're going to go over there. Okay, got it. Now they're not in this room in particular. Also, uh stuffing on the pressure plates kind of me. Oh. Lydia's mentally retarded. Ah, uh, this is else? not gonna be fun. I'm right behind you. So next room is where we gotta worry about the spiders as of right. So, I don't know how everybody else deals with this. I just kind of, like, stay on the platform. So, there's one right there. And there, and there's Mama Spider, who, if you decide to look up because you fucking hate your life and don't have anything to live for, uh, you can actually see resting in a web. I'm not going to do that because, uh, bitch. 
Oh my god, the spider got all your Oh, hell no. Where the fuck are you going? Get your fat ass back over there. Okay, cool. Great. Lydia, you get us over there. Call Mama Spider now, and I'm gonna snipe that bitch from here. But don't die, cause uh. Oh my God, I gotta go over there. I I don't want to do this. Why does it? Ah, fuck. All right, all right, man, the fuck out. Ah, psych, bitch. I'm trying to call it down so that she can deal with it. Because I don't want to deal with it. Slim, how close do I have to be to call down Mama Spider? You see what I'm saying? This is why This is why I don't play. Oh, my God. This is why I don't. This is why I didn't finish Jedi Fallen Order. Fucking arachnophobia. I swear to God. Sweating out of fear and everything. Okay, Mama Spider should be here now. Nope, Mama Spider didn't even decide to come down yet, bitch. Alright, fuck it, let's go. Fuck it, fuck it, let's go. Let's go, right now. Come on. Come on. Don't look up, don't look up. Oh my god, okay, there we go. Okay, hey buddy. Yeah, Lydia, fold that bitch. Good shit, Lydia. We get the fuck out of here before another one show up. But, uh, yeah, no, I got arachnophobia to the highest degree. It is, uh, it has been a problem your boy has been dealing with since, uh, <laughs> early childhood. It's, uh, never going away. Because spiders, look, spiders are God's mistake. Let's, let's just call it, let's call it spade a spade, damn it. Mm. Also thought this dungeon was going to take a lot longer, but fuck no. All right. Now that I'm, uh, not shooting bricks anymore, um, what the fuck? Um, a lot of dead people here. Okay, well, Dragonborn, I need to speak with you urgently. Rent the attic room of the sleeping giant in, in the riverwood and I'll meet you there. Sign a friend. Well, I went out this bitch. Y'all got big ass spiders. It's time for a nigga to move. I'm getting the fuck out of here. And it's dark as balls in here. Um, magic, I'll take that just so I can just kill you. Hard for to go. Slow gym. Minor stamina. High boots. And, uh, nope. We only got one of those in here. Mine. Don't need that. What's in here? Mine. Here. All right. And I'm getting the fuck up out of here before anything else that has eight legs and veins and more eyes than I fucking need to see. He decides to show up and go, hey, I want to be your friend. <clears throat> Get the fuck up out of here. What's in here? Ooh. Ooh, we're at an orchid shagger. Uh... Son of a bitch! I just realized I fucking left Lydia. God damn it. Alright, I gotta go back and get her. Ah, uh, I forgot. So, when you, tell a when you give a partner a command to wait somewhere, they will wait there until it's either told otherwise or until a long enough period of time passes where they're just like, you know what, fuck this, I'm going home. Which, I could do that. But I can't disengage her as a partner like that, so... God damn it, Lydia. Wait, 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 wait. Bring your ass. 
Fuck no, you want to sit in there with a carcass of a spider? Anything else? Yeah. You heading up? Follow me. Fuck no, if you want to sit there forever, you want to sit there with the carcass of a spider. Like more spiders can't close up. All right, get the fuck up out of here. Now we're officially getting the fuck up out of here. All right. All right. Um, oh, by the way, I can she has to, she has Nordic gloves, don't she? I've got your back. Oh, you do. Okay. You lead, I'll follow. I'll find a purpose for these gloves. Anyways, we get the fuck out of here. Oh no, that's, oh shit, that's gonna sound awful, but uh, I thought I heard a fucking rumbling sound in my headphone, I was about to say, um, what? And then come, come to realize, no, it's just cars outside, push, y'all wanna push the fucking engine at 2 in the morning, but uh, you know, it's, it's none of my problem, it's none of my concern. Huh? What you, fuck you hunting for, fuck you know. Anyways, we're heading back to Riverwood now. Boom. That up. Feindel thinks it can be familiar. You there. You're the one they call Dragonborn. Fuck. I am uh I am level ten. I don't know what you're talking about. Lies fall on deaf ears, Deceiver. We know you are the false Dragonborn. You shall not stand in the way of the true Dragonborn's return. He comes soon, and we shall offer him your heart. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. You now. Okay. Ah, ah, did I get hit the guard? Oh, fuck. All right. Well, that's the start for the quest, Dragonborn. Which is the DLC quest. Now, where is the other guy that I just seen? Oh, no. He ran like a bitch. That's crazy. Oh, no. Here he is. You there. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? Uh, tell me vampires? Where do I sign up? Ha! Isran's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawn Guard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Don Guard material. Alright. And that's the start for the sec and that's the thing needed to start the second DLC, the Don Guard. But first let's talk about these cultists, because I kinda actually like their stuff. At least I I gotta like their stuff, or at least the way it's designed. Their cultist robes, 75 percent magic regeneration. Their helmet is heavy armor though, but everything else is light armor, which is weird. Except for their boots. Cultist orders, draw the extra magic for the to go bow, 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 bow. Take it all that, because I can sell all that, yes. Also, I just realized, uh, when I thought about it, their gloves are light armor. Everything else is just, their gloves are light armor, their mask is heavy armor, and their boots and robes are just boots and robes, so yeah. Anyways. I'm the innkeeper. Attic room. Attic room, eh? Well... We don't have an attic room, but you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. All right, cool. What the fuck is this? Oh, oh, this is another bot I have. So, uh, 
I have um, a mod which makes it so that uh, helmets comes with capes. So uh, yeah, maybe I'll, maybe we'll talk about it another time. Oh, now we just sit here and just. So you're the dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. I'll take that. We really don't. I could just take this and go, but fuck it. You got random people. Okay. Today? Damn, take your slow ass time. What's in the chest? Um, I'm taking your 11 gold. Close the door. Can we? The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Uh, you're the one. Okay, hang on. You're the one who took the horn. Try. I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. Uh, what's with the cloak and dagger? You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. They show. Uh, what do you want with me? I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Go on, I'm listening. Like I said in my note. I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. Uh, okay. You said Fabo yes. after you? We're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be Dragonborn. Um, let's see. I might be Dragonborn. Dragons are, liter are literally coming back from the fucking dead. I think one is more important than the other. Uh, anyways, why are you looking for the Dragonborn? We remember what most don't. That the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Uh, I'm sorry, some kind of power for the dragons, that's all I can say. This is no time to play the reluctant hero. You either are or aren't dragon boy. But I'll see for myself soon enough. Okay, so what's the part you're not telling dragons me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life. And I need you to help me stop it. Uh, okay. What makes you think the dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. And I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Uh, okay, so where are we headed? Pines Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Okay. Uh, I'm not ready I yet. I can't wait around for you to make up your mind. I'll meet you at Pines Grove. Don't waste time getting there. Alright. Also. Awesome. Let's get on the road to Pines Grove. Yeah, I'm taking her katana. Because it's a fucking katana. And the weaver me just said, do it. I was, I'm, I'm, I'm robbing this bitch for like everything. So yeah. Um, let's see, what, let me just go, blah, 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 arcade enchanter, uh, what can I, what am I disenchanting, what are these bad boys, what are these bad boys, um, do I even have, I don't have nothing, oh, Riding to white run from I just the blades. I'm not reading that. I thought that was like a skill book. 
Even though I should have really peeped that it wasn't, but okay. Alright. Alright, so uh, I'm not doing that quest right now. Also, I don't know why, but it flashed so fast I thought I was level 100. Um, I'm actually going back to White Run. How far are we in this video? Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go to White Run. And the reason I'm going to White Run is because I want to join the Companions. And, uh, yeah. I'm going to join the Companions, and that will be the last thing I do for this episode before we end it. So, uh, yeah. Also, it's raining out. That sucks. Uh, up here. Damn, I really need to get my stamina up. My character is a badass. Actually, I should probably wait, considering the fact that, uh, you know, it's fucking, like, late as shit and raining. So, ain't nobody gonna be out. Or at least up. Alright. Yorvaska. I think that was called. I'm not even saying because of the name I'm looking at. I'm just saying because of what I what it sound what I remember it sounded like. Base two at it again. Come on now. Oh Watch shit. Keep your balance. Give up, buddy. Still Damn. Hey, watch out. Damn, this bitch cracked to the other side of the fucking road. Damn. 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 I can easily see what it is, right? Damn. Ugh. 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 I swear to God, y'all be swearing by that right hand. Uh, 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 world stop. Damn. Oh, shit. I thought she was going to lose. Fuck it. Whooped his ass. God damn. I'd be dead if not for Vignor. Took me in and helped me turn my life around. That's not how it is. How do I, how do I make it join? If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Uh, can I join? We don't just take in any milk drinker who stumbles in. Talk to Codlack if you think you have what it takes to be a companion. Who the fuck is Codlack? And what the fuck is wrong with drinking milk? Shit, me, Mo. Milk makes the milk does the body good. Also, I think he's down here if I remember correctly. I could be wrong, but uh, here's over. Talk about so we don't just take in any milk drinker. How the Damn, guy, damn, Mo. Uh, if I remember correctly, he's back here. But I still hear the call of the blood. Yeah, that's cool. The whatever. Stranger comes to our home. I want to join. Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Mm. Yes, perhaps a certain strength of spirit, Master. You're not truly considering accepting her. I am exactly. no one's master. Last I checked, we had some empty beds in your vassal for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. I don't have and one. On. Of course. How are you in battle? Uh, I can handle myself. That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test your arm. Vilkas, take her out to the yard and see what she can do. I... You gonna get the fuck up? Take up arms. Sorry. Right. I'm gonna take these down. Or we just go back to this. Ah, I was actually supposed to go back. You know what? We'll, we'll do that after this. Well, not after this. We'll like get that next episode. Have I? Have we met? I'm sorry. 
Well, like to start the next episode, we'll just uh, finish this out. Now, where the fuck you go? Damn, Slim, you move like you in a hurry. Oh my god, we got this katana. Fucking weed for life. Good to have a look at you. So, let's do this. Just have a few swings at me so I can see your form. Don't worry, I can pay you. Alright. You're mine. There you go. Hey. Not bad. Next time won't be so easy. You might just make it. But for now. You're still a whelp to us, you blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorlin to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Really? Alright. Um, anyways, I'm going to end this episode of Elder Scrolls V Skyrim right here. What is um, it now? Might as well, because uh, ain't no point in getting into anything interesting with the companions at the moment. So yeah, when we come back, we're gonna return. We're gonna uh, do this guy's little quest for his sword, and then we're gonna return the horn to the Greybeards. So uh, yeah, with that being said, this is Journey Place. How do y'all say peace? Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, want to go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, and uh, I'm out.